I tried to stay cool, but as soon as I got Emma and, you know, the first time we were alone together, I was like, what was it in the name of the father, man? Give me some stories. Yeah. Like, you know, like, uh, what happened in Remains of the Day? I want to know what happened. Like, Sorry, guys. I My face, I don't know what is wrong with today. It's so red. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus, you look great. <laughs> it's the red background. It's the red so, background. Yeah. I think so. I think so. <laughs> Guys, this movie has so much heart to it. When when you you know that the likes of Jemina has worked years on it, does that make it extra special for you when you're in it? Totally. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, she's lived that experience. She's yeah, it's been what, 10 years of making or something. Yeah. Like it's it's yeah, and to have a to have been the sort of rom com genre, but having the emotional depth of of a drama is is mm-hmm. the dream, really. Yeah. Mm-hmm. And it was, and you do feel that when a movie's taken a long time to sort of come around, you feel that excitement and that fire when it starts coming together. And I, you know, I got the script, and Shazad was already attached, and we're such great friends from a long, long, long time. So it was just, it sort of felt like it was meant to be, and it was a really exciting moment. And having Shaker direct it and bringing so much kind of depth and experience of filmmaking it was it felt each day felt kind of special mm. uh, I was talking to some of the cast earlier on and it kind of feels like you guys are all a family now would that be true to say that yeah, yeah I mean it was that's the thing about acting you just sort of jump straight into this and you, yeah. you they are they are your family for like well it was an eight week shoot mm-hmm. and suddenly everyone's just you, you're living that experience you're, you're eating dinner together you're, mm-hmm. you're crying and laughing together so it's it's it does it just happens that way it's yeah. a very acting is weird acting is it's just such weird. a weird thing but it's a really beautiful thing and yeah you know I have my little family with Emma but also we were all like you know there's the line about like make up your village like w- these two houses next door that had grown up together and then were learning more and more about each other and um understanding more about each other and who they are and what they've lived through and their history and it's just such a beautiful um exploration uh, without judgment and with 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 sort of an open heart it's really lovely lily having your mom as emma thompson is it as good as i would like it to be better it's better <laughs> it's so good <laughs> i have to be careful because of my poor mom but <laughs> no i'm <laughs> kidding i love you mom um no emma was amazing on every level i mean she's just one of the greatest actors ever and um she's just such a beautiful kind funny person and it was just to have her in this film I mean it just elevates it to a whole new level and she's you know and the same with Shabana who is incredible oh. um yeah she's similar yeah, leg- yeah legend, legend. In, legend in her own right just I mean when I told my cousin that she was in it my cousin actually cried because <laughs> they because she used to with my auntie who passed away they used to grow up watching Shabana so I was like and she was like what and she it was a very emotional mm-hmm. it's a big deal it was a big deal it's a big deal this mm-hmm. cast you know I like working with people that Rahat Ali, Ali Han Jemima Khan when I'm telling my family that these people are involved it's like you know and Emma Thompson yeah <laughs> it's, like, it's crazy it's an amazing cast this has just and been G. and Jemani G <laughs> This has been nosy on my part, but when you're sitting down, you know, doing the read-throughs and all that, do you, do you get to ask about the past movies that they've been in? Like, are you as nosy as anyone else would be? Or you're saying, I'm an actor, I can't yeah, do Yeah, no, no, no. I tried to stay cool, but as soon as I got Emma and, you know, the first time we were alone together, I was like, what was it in the name of the father, man? Give me some stories. Yeah. Like, you know, like, uh, what happened in Remains of the Day? I want to know what happened. Like, I literally did ask her that and she was like, and she gave me some stories later on. But yeah, it was good. It's hard not to when they've made when there's these sort of like legendary movies as well with some of these great like Hopkins. I mean, come on. Yeah. So, but um, and we had a funny night where we were playing charades and it was like Shabana and Emma and us and Sajal and we were all yeah. playing charades together and it was quite sort of like funny watching them act out movies, <laughs> being these great actors. Uh, it was cool. Um, I, do you think people are going to walk away and look at assisted marriages differently? You know, because I would have not known anything about it. And then going into a, into a movie, there's something quite wholesome about it, I would have found. Like, different. Yeah. I hope, hopefully that's what, you know. We, um, we set out to so, achieve. Yeah, yeah, yeah like, the, give people the, that's not just a stereotype, you know, that, that's something different and it's not crit- criticised in the movie at all. And it's, yeah, and it shows them 
shows them the, with the intricacies of the, we show mm. every step really and it's kind yeah. of you know, it is very informative and I think that's a good thing like really diff, 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 oh, I can't say the word now but finding the difference between um, forced marriage and assisted marriage like how different that is and looking at it and knowing that millions of couples are across the world have assisted marriages so in no way is this a criticism it's a, a love letter actually to Pakistan and to different and the different ways and traditions and approaches to falling in love yeah, it's just an um, exploration. Yeah, it's mm. not even. Mm. Yeah. I, I'm without giving away, you know, what had happened, but in the part where, you know, at the end of it, where the filming piece came out, and have you guys watched people watch it yet to hear they gasp? You know, there's a moment in it when, you know, someone else or two people arrive in it. Like, I'll, I'll edit, edit this part anyway. But yeah. you know, when, when uh, your sister comes on, and all of a sudden it's like, oh. <gasps> I watched it with about 20 people and hearing that gasp going, oh God, oh, the wow. fear of God. Have you had that yet? I I watched the film in Toronto <laughs> where it premiered at the festival and it was amazing. Hearing the laughter, hearing the sort of like recognition of people laughing at moments within the family and stuff. It was some of the biggest laughs I've of a film I've ever been in witnessing in an audience. And that is so special. Like it's unbelievable. I still haven't seen you it. You haven't seen it with an audience. Yeah, I haven't seen oh! it yeah, so I, yeah, I yeah. can't wait. We've something to we're, we're gonna invite all our, we're, <laughs> we're, like, to see it. <laughs> we're desperate to get more tickets for the premiere because we have so many friends in common. So yeah. we just want like this whole gang of our London friends to be there. So we're we're gonna be pestering working yeah. title yeah yeah <laughs> amazing <laughs> guys my time is uh, wrapped up so uh talk to you soon and it was a lovely movie it really was the end part oh my days i was oh, like what? yeah thank, thank you very much talk to you soon bye-bye